Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video at Special Place today. And guys, I'm sorry I quit Clash Royale. I don't know why I got so bored of it. So guys, I'm gonna I'm starting new games, okay? And I quit laptop gaming because I have no recording software at all. But anyways, forget about all that. So now guys, what we're gonna do is that we're gonna play this three new games, Clash of Clans. Honor Bound and NBA Live Mobile. So currently I'm now on Honor Bound and what it is is that okay, so um it's like a superhero game with different different creatures and your main creature is the guy who's standing in the middle and his name is Pyromancer. Oh I named him Repressor, but whatever. So I named him Repressor and I'm gonna explain each thing in detail so you guys understand. Okay, so we get okay. So the first character you get in this game is your main character. And he's he can either be a guy called Celestial Sage, Pyromancer, uh, some fairy lady, um, Shadow Knight, and yeah, those are the main characters. And they will have the most health and the best stats. If you see, he has like great stats and everything is so awesome. Okay? So now what we're going to do is we're going to talk about the other three characters over there. So there are three different types, okay? We have the commons, the uncommons, the rares, epics, and legendaries. The epics are obviously the second best. And um, all of my cards here are epics. And you can see that because of their symbols. So now um, my I have four different cards. And you can't just get four different cards okay you need to have different you have to unlock slots by actually going through the campaign so each time you beat a particular leader and that you'll get a fourth slot or first slot or third slot whatever you want so now like let me explain the story so the story is basically you start off with this lady called Nema and she turns out to be good you think she's good but at the end she just turns back and she like takes out this whole village to herself and you have to conquer. See, just look at this. If I click battle, right? Okay, so basically these are all the things with the swords, things that I have not completed. The areas which Neymar has captured, things which I have not completed are um, denoted by this symbol. The things that I have completed, you can see obviously. So now we're going to talk about Ember Barons. So these Barons can be used to actually um, upgrade stuff. So I'm just going to show you. So and each time you beat people, you get XP. And when you get XP, that can be used to level up your cards. Um, now if you think this is a pretty good level, it's not. Because I really need to show you the other players. But before that, you can be in a clan, have friends. And look at these guys. Level 88. And... They're not even the best. They're like far from best. And look at me. I'm really, really far. Okay, and there's something called energy. So what energy is, is that you need to, to you need, you use one energy per one step, which really sucks in my opinion. But that's how the game works. Now, when you click squad here. Come on. Okay. So the squad is basically all the characters you have. And these are the four characters I'm using. You're maximum only allowed to have five slots. Okay, so now these are all the cards I have, not too many. And I have in total seven epics, guys, and that's really good. And the music is also pretty nice. While we're waiting, we can listen to it. Okay, now we can do click research. So what research is, is basically you need to upgrade stuff like your the capacity of your ember wall or the capacity of your energy. So just click research here. Okay, now look at it. Your commander. So your commander is the people I told you about. Your main character is your commander. You can put a leadership for. So basically what is leadership? You need to upgrade levels, right? For that, each time you move up 10 levels, you need to buy another leadership. So if I want to, if I've reached the 10th level, to get to the 11th level, level level 11 to level 20 is leadership 2, and so on and so forth. Now, um, the ranks, okay, wait, I need to explain this too. 
okay so ritual leave rituals i'll come to that later okay so let's leave this okay what is rank okay so rank is basically just like leadership you can upgrade your rank and that's only the way you can upgrade it oh sorry yeah yeah okay so um yeah whatever alchemy oh my god i really need to move this in a proper position yeah this will be better oh no that's where my battle thing is okay put it here okay and then yeah the embers you can um get, you can buy something to get it a lot of fast like really really fast and something to get super fast which is middle ember gain and rapid ember gain summoning so um you can use this okay so basically this are the four commanders and if you want to summon another commander then you can use these coins i don't have any right now but it doesn't matter so um you can summon celestial sage and this is how he looks and then this is shadow knight sylvian protector spirit sentinel the wolf guy i was talking about fire heart and this is the best guy i'm not even joking gyer the undefeated he is so good and people even have him okay so now i explained it quite a bit okay now the arena you can battle people online and yeah that's it that's how you need to know now let's go to rituals downloading content okay so banish evolve and fortify what is banish you can banish your cards to get money which you really need i think and then evolve you can upgrade your heroes and fortify you can combine two heroes and make them get a lot of xp so i've explained it a lot let's explain my characters now this is pyromancer she is a lady just saying Oh god. Um you know what let's just waste those. Okay, so my attribute is now level 3 and that gains a lot. I just wasted 38 gems but I don't really care. Okay, now leave him. Okay, so now this guy is the wild count. I got him by trading with one of my friends and his stats are pretty good too. I use him for attack. See, that sword thing is attack. normal attack it's 2338 guys great his magical attack so okay so we have archers rogues knights and magicians he is a rogue okay and he has they have different abilities it's called steel okay you can when you what their ability means is that when he comes and stabs somebody he gets money he takes it from them basically okay so yeah whatever stats For me he's my favorite character, Runewood Forester. And if you're you're wondering what these things are here, they are rings. And these rings what they do is they give little extra power to the character. So my Runewood here does not have that much defense. So I gave him a ring called Ring of Defense. If you see here, a pristine ring of health. So he gets a little more health. Okay, so let's get into a small battle here. Let's go into our first map. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you. These are mines, okay? And you capture them and they give you free money, which is so awesome in my opinion. So I'm going to go into the goblin tribes and I've completed 3 out of 5 already. So let's get in here. That's my mom talking over there if you can hear. Come on. Okay. Welcome. It looks like some fool has wandered into my territory. Looks like it's my lucky day. Your hide will make a fine cloak. Oh dude, that's just rude. La area start. Okay, now just see. Each time I move energy. So I just lost an energy. Okay. Okay, so I'm battling these three. Okay, so that power up is basically gives them extra defense. Okay, so let's easily. So this is a these two are uncommons and this is a rare. So let's attack the rare first. What? Oh, he didn't take anything. So this is aim shot and its ability with the archers and they do so much more damage. Just see how much damage it does. Look at that. 
so much damage okay so now uh, let's move on to um let's move on to um getting this guy out so let's kill him and my, look at the damage he does oh no he doesn't do anything for now okay we need to kill these guys pretty quickly okay let's not aim shot him let's aim shot him so he dies immediately oh my god i hate this okay thank you so now he's gonna do a little bit of damage let's kill this guy now yeah okay oh my god 1486 damage that is so awesome okay um let's play two more battles okay so now if you see that part over his head it's a minor heal potion and you can give that to him so regain his health a little bit because he saw how he lost health okay so again we won't be able to hit him but that's okay because just see okay so they already have their ability on i don't want to talk to you now what's up let's get some money off him shall we so that did no damage at all Let's kill him with this. And let's shoot him. Oh no. Okay, look. Archers have super less health. And that's the only problem with them. But their damage is a lot. So there's nothing to complain about, really. Oh my god. My archer is going to die pretty soon. So we need to revive him. We have a lot of money. So we can easily buy some minor heal potions. Okay, um, let's buy some more, some more, some more, okay. Perfect. So let's play this one last battle and let's call it a video. Yeah, I'm sorry, if you could hear my mom talking, it was just that she, we had to go, we have to go out somewhere right now. So she's calling me. So I'm just going to finish this video pretty quick. So which does the least damage? Um, what, what's the thing which I can waste? Okay, yeah, so now let's aim shot him and he's gonna die for sure, please. Oh my god, how did he not die? Not good. Not good at all. We need to kill this guy pretty quick. What? You're kidding me, right? Oh, and a nice shot, dude. Nice shot. That's it. Okay, great. So we're slowly increasing. We're slowly... We're gonna beat this level. And just because... I'm just talking and having fun. I really think we're gonna beat this level. Let's give some minor heal potions. Come on. Come on. Okay. Yeah, guys. Thanks a lot. This will be the end of the video. Um, um, I hope you guys have a great day. And see you later. Bye.